Hello everyone, it is I, Nightmare Keys, and welcome back to another video. And remember, the only lock stopping you from opening the door to the world of internet mysteries and ARGs is you not clicking that subscribe button. What I'm trying to imply is that you should subscribe if you like content like this. Anyway, today we're going to be covering one of the best ARGs in 2020. It's up there with some of my favorites, like, uh, of 2020, like, They Spy Us, Mental Glitch, and Instar Labs. Instar Labs is an ARG that you probably have heard of, you just haven't looked into it. But trust me, you need to look into this. Before we get into this video, I'd recommend you at least go check out the channel. If you don't want to, that's fine, I'll try to explain it the best that I can. In this video, we're only going over phase one out of three. The Instar Labs rabbit hole goes deep. People have said there's up to 20 sites, but I believe there's only a few. There's tons of channels posting stuff like every few days to weeks because Instar Labs has been on a bit of a hiatus, I'd say. I don't know, but for the past two weeks, there's only been like an upload when usually there's an upload every few days. Either way, Still a really good ARG. So let's get into this. We're going to start by covering some of the Phase 1 videos. We're not going in over any of the websites. Extra content, Phase 2 or Phase 3. This is probably going to be a four-part series. First, we're going over Phase 1, then Phase 2, then Phase 3, and then extra content. And that's about all. Let's get into this. That's, that's a 1 minute 40 second long intro. That's my longest. Also guys, I just wanted to say I have been a game developer for a little bit and I've started using RPG Maker. I'll leave some links to my side project of that game if you want to watch footage of it in the description. Anyways, let's get into the first video on the InstaLabs channel. We're going to do a speed round of the first few videos on this channel because the first few videos, no offense, are very interesting. The first video is an upload of a song. The second video is an upload of a video called Airship Crash. This has 500 views, however, it's one of the least interesting videos on the channel. Just depicts something flying in the sky and then a candle. Next video is Instar Labs Pickups, which appears to be showing a radio screen of some sort, picking up allegedly Instar airship signals. But the next video is very, very interesting, and we have to talk about it. Next video is known as Airship, and I just wanted to say uh, I might put in footage here of how this was discovered, but inside of the static, this video is just 17 seconds of static. If you take screenshots from frames of this video, change the negative values, put them into something like Photoshop, then overlay the images, you can find like an actual uh, image. That doesn't make much sense, but basically what they did, they took, somebody took screenshots from the actual video, then they layered them on top of each other on Photoshop and slid them into each other and they found like an image. It was a picture of a cicada referencing cicada 3301 with the digits 0301. Once again, a uh, reference to cicada 3301. This was very interesting and this showed that this was not just some little wimpy AIG someone cooked up. This is serious. Like that, that is a hard code to find. Next video is a 30 second clip known as The White Figure Haunts Me. It shows what appears to be a TV screen with somebody asking, Does it still scare you? and Does the white figure still haunt you? I found this video very interesting and it looks looks very well made, so go check that video out. Uh, it has the most story rub, um, it has the most story out of these few videos because what this is saying is that there is a white figure haunting the main character of this ARG. So that's what we knew at the time, but as the story goes on in the phase two, you'll see what this white figure is and how much of an impact it has on the plot. The next video is known as, I didn't want this, I never wanted this. I'm gonna do a read through of it right now. The redacted coming for me has never redacted. I just wanted to help Redacted. I didn't want this. I never wanted this. Thousands are dead of because of what I created. I didn't want this. I didn't want this. I never wanted this. I just wanted to help. Redacted still haunts me in my dreams, assuming, assumedly, the white figure. It's near. I can feel its present, I, presence. I never wanted this. Might Redacted might catch me. I wanted a peaceful life, but some things will never happen. 
that's all that video is. It's just a 30 second video with that text on screen. There's some pretty creepy effects and this video is one of the most popular, if not the kind of most popular video on the channel with 1.7 thousand views as of the time of uploading this. I don't know why this is, but maybe it's because this was the previous channel trailer so whenever someone clicked on this channel they see that video. Anyways, let's get into the next video. The next video is called my greatest mistake was my greed. The text at the start of the video reads, I want to try something dot 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 new. I made a deal with Redacted to help them make a sentient super rep weapon. Sentient, yet trainable. I'm so pumped about this. I called it Project Redacted. This is going to make Redacted big bucks. I assume, and as has been confirmed within Phase 2, that the white figure is actually the super weapon, and that the white figure haunts the main character of this AIG, who is not yet named, because of what he, yes, it is a he, we find out later, created. And this is this is kind of sad inside the AIG story, because this person was paid, as known by the title of the video, My Greatest Mistake Was My Greed, uh, to make this weapon, and now the person regrets it. So. This is just like a pretty sad video, but let's get on to the next view. Next video is called It Just Floats There and starts off with the text A Month Incubation and I have noticed it is conforming into a humanoid shape. This is exactly what I wanted, although it has no legs and it just dot 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 floats there. Also, if it sounds like I'm studying or making spelling mistakes, <laughs> not spelling mistakes, making like grammatical mistakes, that is actually in the actual video, so you can go and read it, which is interesting because it just seemed kind of weird that this has been thought out so thoroughly, however it has these like weird grammatical mistakes. I don't know, maybe English isn't the first person who made this language. But let's get into the next video. I am such a hypocrite. That last sentence I said made no grammatical sense. Yet I am talking about this AOG not making grammatical sense. Anyways, on to the next video. The next video is known as no, 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 dot, dot, dot. It's gone. And the opening text says, I don't want them to know. I'm hiding in a bunker in my lab. Hopefully it'll be safe. I'm so error. If anyone's out there, please rid the world of that monster. Basically what happened in this video is that the main character finds out that the white figure had escaped from containment. Now, knowing that the white figure is a super weapon, this is basically like letting an atomic bomb into the public's hands. And apparently the white figure starts wreaking havoc on all of current society. So... I mean, the, the plot just went from like 10 to 100 in about one or two videos. Uh, we're going to skip the next video because it's nothing of note. It's called My Fault and it just has some Unicode stuff. Uh, there's some decoding and it just says stuff about in cell labs. So no low importance there. You can actually skip a few videos including the Slash video. However, the video after that is just known as Notes and it depicts the notes of the main character talking about how they went to a store risking their life because the white figure has been set loose on humanity. There's also Raiders, like Fallout style, I assume, and such. So this is risking the main character's life just going outside. Anyways, that's about all for those two videos. Uh, three videos, because we skipped over two. But then let's get into a final video of Phase 1. The video starts off with, How am I still alive? A group of what I call raiders attacked my lab. I hid in my room and set up an old turret I had. They busted down the door and got mowed down from the bullets. It was so da 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 bloody, and I can't believe I did that. I took their weapons. Only one person was left alive. He told me that our hit is the only thing that can make me glitchy letters. I think her name was Espen. I'm a monster. It's funny that now the main character is considering themselves a monster after murdering a few people despite being a supposed weapons contractor making a super weapon for either Insta Labs or for the government, then it going loose on humanity and killing millions or thousands. So I just don't really understand this video. But anyways, that's all for phase one. I really didn't explain this well. I didn't do many retakes of the script. I'm sorry. I've been kind of like uh, working on a lot of projects at once, so this video was kind of delayed and also is a bit badly made. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. After the monster video, Insta Labs entered uh, phase two, didn't upload for like a year or maybe more like seven months. Um, and yeah, now we're on phase three at the current moment. I'll cover phase two in another video. That's not going to be a long, that's going to be a long time from now. 
is I want to do that around Halloween because it's spooky. Anyway, guys, subscribe. I'm just going to order. This is a demand on order. Subscribe. If you are not subscribed, you you are bad. Also, check the description. I have some interesting stuff in there. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye.